the motor and went to the back, so he's looking for a victory, and there's a caution on the track. Turn two, guys. Oh, Caution's out. Got a big fire on the back stretch off turn two. It's Michael McDowell. Heavy contact for McDowell, and he's trying to get the car down to the inside. Lots of flames inside the car. Yeah, he needs to get that car to a stop and get out of it because that. See the fire truck coming as quickly as he can get there to get the car pulled over and get out, Michael. He's broken an oil line. I think it's completely line. exploded. Good to see Michael jump right out of there. Yeah, Michael's a pretty Burn good sized guy, so sometimes a little now. more difficult to get out of there, but he did a nice job. Hate to see it after a great qualifying effort. Top finishing rookie last week at Daytona, 14th place finish, only his seventh ever start in the series, and uh, he said it just uh, blew up in a, in a big way. Yeah, it sounded like he might have been talking about a tire, possibly. He said it exploded. So we'll see here that uh, this car's hit the wall. See, he does hit the wall there. I don't know if it was a tire, maybe ran over something. That thing was already on fire before he hit those. Could have so blown that, up. Yeah, the could, engine could have blown up, and then he got in the other one. Got the in bottom. There. Yeah. That is a lot of fire. Yeah, that oil makes an intense fire when you put a lot of air on it, like you see here, with about still going about 50 or 60 miles an hour. Yeah, terrible feeling as a driver to be sitting in there. You want to stop. You're trying to find a fire truck to make sure that you, since he can, drive it and get there. Uh, but you just want to get out of there as quickly as you possibly can. You see.